What's up guys, welcome back to another video. In this video, I will show you how to add a co-host in Google Meet. So, you might be wondering how to exactly add a co-host here in Google Meet. So, adding a co-host is something really useful, like if you want someone to host for you, just in case something happens in your ad here. So, this is going to be something really useful. But, what you need to do is, let's go ahead and start creating a start. Let's go ahead and create a meeting first. Let's go ahead and click on new meeting. Let's go ahead and click on start an instant meeting. Now, let's just wait for this to load up. Now, once it's actually loaded up, what we need to do next is we want to go ahead and change a few things here. Now, at the bottom right here, you should see a lock icon. Go ahead and click on it. Now, from here, you want to go ahead and turn on host management. Now, once you've done that, what we need to do next here is we just need to access another setting here, which in this case, you want to go to people at the bottom right again, and you want to go and locate the person that you want to go ahead and promote as a co-host. So example, we have this person here. Let's go and click on the G data option. And in here, you should have the option that says promote to co-host or add as co-host or something similar to that. But the thing with this one is in order for you to add someone as a co-host, you need to have a specific version of your Google account or Google Workspace. Now, this is a paid feature that Google has. So if you don't have like Google Workspace or Google, a specific version of Google One, well, unfortunately, you won't be able to add co-hosts into your meetings here. But yeah, so in this case, that's about it. So if you found this video helpful, don't forget to leave a like or maybe subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching.